Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Galactic Civilizations 3 with me, Get Dave. We have... We have ourselves a new citizen. I think we're going to go with a leader again. I value social production very highly. They had... A fleet I was slightly concerned about. Oh, there it is. There you are. All right, we actually have some damage here. Do we have any propulsion left? One more. Well, let's just let them panic. And then send this old thing in. All right, Mars is idling. Okay, so they're here to do some some research, some money. All good things. We'll go for some more money once they're ready. Uh, also, I've kind of been neglecting the fact that I have a massive surplus of food. Uh, you are not the advanced one. You, however, are. And this could be a very nice place to have all sorts of things. The approval is only 80%, so we would have to do a little bit of a little bit of finagling to make to make it work, but I think a city would be okay. Where would be a good spot for it? Cities also boost a whole bunch of stuff. I could plunk one right here. Or even right there. They're good to bridge uh, very different areas. So let's do that, and then we'll trash the military academy, I think, and then replace that with something else. We, we have other military academies now. Oh man, the adequate. You weren't. Snath aside, I think, has been largely replaced. Legendary sword, let's... uh. Let's do one iteration on it. We're just gonna change up its defenses a little bit. By which I mean re remove them all and then send it into combat. Wow. Or we could have a really awesome propulsion system on it. and give it 20% dodge. You know, on the right ship, because we have that 30% dodge bonus already, we could get it up to a 50% defense bonus. Hmm. It's awfully heavy. I think we'll go with traditional defenses for now. And let's gird your underbelly. And your ribs. I'm a little shaken by what happened with that starbase as well. So I think a more versatile defense 
setup will be a good idea. Yeah, so I mean, it, it's lower overall, but I think the diversity is a good thing. Oh, put a little bit of, a little bit of hull right there. Yeah, and we're getting some nice bonuses if this is in a certain fleet. All right, the legendary sword too. Thirteen versus fourteen. That's still pretty good. More hit points, same firepower. Yeah, I'd say it's an upgrade. All right, Q1 up. All right, what a long turn that was. Are they coming for me? Looks like they're coming for me in a couple spots. I think he just realized this starbase meant business. Cool. Or is that the evacuation fleet? Um... I want to pick these off because I have the opportunity. Yeah, look at them using missiles now. Oh, never mind. Those Thalons. Are they getting a benefit from a military starbase? I'm not sure. Let's watch. It seems to go better when we do. Oh, hang in there, little guy. It survived one-ish. I'm not really sure why these guys are holding back. Going after the despoiler, but it was destroy. I don't know. All right, let's watch, shall we? Just a whole bunch of really tiny ones. Oh boy. Took a pounding. Please open fire. I... don't exactly understand a lot. <laughs> If I were to fall to the game in one area, it would be the very opaque and terrible ship combat system. Um, a downgrade from what was already quite bad, which is a shame. I mean, it also seems like it'd be kind of an easy fix. All right, let's watch. I'd say you're in trouble, pal. See, now they're going for it. Uh, I guess my tip would be just make every single ship an escort. Like, they have these complicated rules. That's an escort. Why does it spawn so much further behind? It would make an excellent tank with its defenses. Who sets these distances? I don't know. Uh, 
Oh yeah, the approval relic. All right. Oh, right. Insufficient funds available? We have a major tech resistance, that's nice. Place your legions. It looks like there's only a few spots I can go for. Well, I guess that's why there were so few things for me to take. That's okay. That's still crippling for them. All right, that leaves us with an empty transport, I assume? Or do we lose the transport now? Uh, quick battle so we can lose a critical ship. We'll cycle over there next. Okay. A little disappointing, but not the end of the world. Yeah, they're having some problems. Do we have a count on the number of legions defending them? Okay. I guess I need to manufacture more and faster, though. Well, we'll have two available. Three wasn't enough. We'll have a general available as well. Let's just get a transport up ahead, shall we? Needs to have at least two legions? Okay, I can wait one turn. All right, what can I get that'll make it easier to destroy a planet? I mean, visit one. Ah! Uh, sounds good. Cultural optimization. All right, let's go for that. Cheaper construction, cheaper maintenance. I'll take cheaper construction. All right, legions available. Because as it turns out, we just got a general. All right, progress tempor temporarily halted. Oh. Victory certain, but that's a lot of firepower. It's not helping them that much. The Thalons gonna be able to take their home world? I mean, there'll be lots for me to pick up if that's not the case. And the Thalons helped me a lot. I mean, they've been donating. Well, some of their ships have ended up in Snathy control anyway. But early on when the Snathy had a huge fleet, 
Um, the Thalons basically kept them off my back by using what is essentially guerrilla tactics over there. All right, approval has taken a hit. So let's drop the computer core. Yeah, in favor of... Uh, where's our entertainment? There we go. Morale plus one. And then they will love me. Uh, no. Next question. Yep, the Thalons got it. Piggybacking my hard work. Uh, that is fine. They have giant crosshairs on them for the near future. Alright, how is this all snaffy territory? Big old fancy starbase that I don't really want to attack. Sharing that exploration... Wow, how is Onyx so powerful? They don't seem to control much territory. I guess they have a few clusters of good planets, but like in terms of borders, they got nothing. Well, that's an interesting thought. All right, in the meantime... Let's see if we can rocket through these turns rather quickly. I have something I want to get to. Also, I think off camera that at Mordecai there was a massive battle. An epic moment. Ooh, harpoons. No, but you're talking my language now. I'll give you life support miniaturization. Uh, what else do they like? Anything but point defense. There we go. And you give me some of your massive sums of money. Alright. So they'd be a bit of a bite to chew, but that's okay. Torians, you got any weapons? Yeah, you do. Oh, you're almost interested in it, though. Just needed $11. Just a tip. Like, okay, they have 112 ships. That's what it is. Are they any good? I think we have to say the answer is no. I mean, some of these have like good variety offense, but on the whole, I'd say that's pathetic. All right, it's all good. A snathy ship coming after a large hull support ship. with nothing on it. I don't know. Uh, infinite Jihad government 
go on. That tickles my fancy. Oh, hey, farmers. We're just gonna look into point defense for no reason whatsoever. Really, really good point defense. Snathy treating for peace. Uh, you'll give me... And you can see what I see. For 50 turns? Yeah, okay. Yeah, it'd be nice to have hypersilicates, I think. Whoops, that's not the one I want. Yeah, I know I'm trying to go in a hurry, but it's not happening. All right, Teddy Boson. Surely we can promote you to something good now. Nope. We need Epimetheus or Aurorus. Well, we'll worry about that later. All right, one turn. Delightful. United Earth has declared rev <laughs> What a cheesy time to declare war. Bandwagon hopper. Yeah, load it up. You're here to take home worlds. Alright, follow at a safe distance. I have a colony, I must know. Approval's back up to 100%. I'm likely to stay there. We're gonna have to figure out... Well, a lot, to be honest. Look at the production, though. Look at it slowly skyrocket. Colony at Iriondo. They could train people. This has the potential to be a fairly productive planet. Also, really good financial capital possibility here. We just don't have the super cluster. We have here, which is pretty good. All right, let's do that. People like it. Yeah, and they're still plugging away. Okay. We don't even have those planned yet. Transport has a bajillion moves left because it's got ion drive. Just kidding. You hang out there for a little bit. Might have to start considering putting ion drives on my ships. Just because the size of the map is becoming a bit of a sticking point occasionally. Are you coming for me? The Onyx Hive? Yeah, I'm not so sure I believe that. No, we'll worry about government later. Also, I feel like I shouldn't reformat it three, three weeks before an election. Now there, there's a scandal. Fist of the sun. Just a whole bunch of little tiny missile cruisers. I would love to eat them all. All right, let's watch. It's disaster when we don't. All right, he had a good run. Hang in there, legendary sword. 
It's a Mark 1, so it can take a lot of... Well, it doesn't matter anymore. It's got a lot of armor. I can really ionize that hull plating. Oh, it's gonna be a shame we won't get a galactic mainframe. Thank you. Watch it happen. We might speed this one up. Good. Looks like everyone came out pretty clean. A couple nickels of damage. Yeah. Moves 13. The Otter Bay. Well, I was thinking... Yeah, approval's already down, and we have a city going. It's getting all those adjacency bonuses. I don't want that to be the one I get rid of. That's not a great approval place. Uh, this one's okay. Alright, that'll give us a level 2 entertainment center. It's a start. And you... We'll consider the attacker for later. One ship defending. No one's defending over there. We really should get on that. All right, our new acquisition. Trillikins. Surprising no one, I like to encircle the colony's starting point. Because it gets uh, some nice adjacency bonuses. That's flexibility, that's what that is. Could make the case that here would have been a better option. Because we could give ourselves a perfect ring. Oh well, I say. Those are all defended. One, two, three. He could destroy my transport, so. Just drop you back. It has absurd propulsion. Yeah, it's actually barely safe even there. Come on, give me one more turn. I dare you. My devil dog dare you. One of our traders has been approached. Oh, black market. Oh, they want access to some of our research? Hmm. Plus 25% trade income. And I get some malevolent. Yeah. <laughs> You've changed, Dave. Uh, yeah, let's watch it. For tradition. Because this is also... This is probably the end. There we go. Undefended. So let's go visit. They fought hard. They're all dead.
The Snathy Revenge has been destroyed, or have been destroyed. And that, folks... Well, there's a moral to the story. Let's just leave it at that. That's why you leave me alone. I would have saved him for last. <laughs>